Hey everyone, this is DWS Darius, and today we are in a fish room. And today I just want to give you all a big thank you. I want to thank everybody who's been supporting my channel, everybody who's been subscribing. Recently I just passed 5,000 subscribers, which is huge for me. Also, my channel has surpassed a million views, so that's just awesome because you know the first intent of me making a YouTube channel, the first reason why I made my videos was to get identifications for my African cichlids. Um, and ever since then, I've been getting nonstop support from you guys, nonstop encouragement. And now I am where I am today. All these aquariums, all these experiences, thanks to you guys. So a big thank you for that. I want to thank you all for this encouraging community. Um, I love the fact that I'm able to go with any question to you guys and get an answer, whether it's fish related or not. Um, just all the support I get from you guys. I really appreciate it. I get a bunch of you guys that are just always watching my videos, always giving me suggestions, comments, advice, just everything that a person needs to stay encouraged and to enjoy this hobby. So big thank you for that. Now that's the main reason why I grabbed the camera, but I figure I might as well give you a little bit of content to go along with that thank you. So I decided to make this also a video to show my top three aquarium fish as of today. The reason why I say that is because that position is always changing. I always have different favorite fish, so this is going to be my top three favorite fish um, as of this week. So first off, we're going to start in my 55 gallon planet aquarium. And this is a fish I just showed you recently, and it is my hill stream loach. Um, as the weeks go by, I fall more and more in love with this fish. You can see him along the substrate. And I'm falling so much in love with these fish that I'm actually starting a new tank for them. But that's for a different video. But yeah, I'm starting to fall in love with these fish. I love just the way they look, the overall behavior. They're very active. You know, a lot of sucker fish spend a lot of time hiding. This is not the case with these fish, these fish, the discus. These fish are extremely active and just definitely some awesome fish. I um, said in another video that they look very similar to stingrays. Um, yeah, and I'm just loving these fish. I love the look of these fish. I love the activity of these fish. You could very well expect to see some more on this channel. But yeah, that's one of my top three fish as of March 2017. After that, we're going to go over to my 125 gallon African cichlid tank to show you my next two top fish as of now. So my next one is a fish that you've all seen before. One of the oldest fish that I currently keep, and that is my beautiful female jewel cichlid. This cichlid is just so beautiful. I've had her for so long, and the entire time that I've had her, she's been showing that nonstop beauty. She has that bright red, the blue speckles, and then a the yellow belly. Just an overall beautiful fish. She's been through so much. Um, she's a tough little fish. She's in here with cichlids almost twice her size, and she still holds her own pretty well. And just, she definitely deserves a medal. She's so beautiful and she's consistent with her beauty. Definitely making her one of my top three fish as of today. A gorgeous fish. And lastly, my top three fish is my flameback. Now recently I've been becoming very addicted to Victorian cichlids because a lot of them can carry a lot of red. Um, I've been trying to find some good ones. Right here is a salmon hap. I wanted it to be a male, turned out being a female. I also bought a Nerei, which is starting to look like a female. And finally, I went and purchased this um, Flameback. And as you can see, I got lucky because he is definitely a male and he's a beauty. He's only two inches showing his color. He's not fully dominant. So imagine if he is fully dominant, how much color he would show. But yeah, I love this fish because it's a color that I've been looking for so long. Um, that red on, just that red upper body. That's a design on cichlids that I've been wanting for a while now. And I finally get it, and he's just such a beautiful fish. So YouTube, as of today, those are my top three aquarium fish. But you know, I keep over 100 fish, and that position is just going to constantly change. But yeah, those are a look at my top current fish. But as I said, the main focus of this video, the main purpose of me grabbing this camera was to thank you all. I appreciate all that you guys do. I appreciate that support. I appreciate the thumbs up. I appreciate the comments. And just everybody, I appreciate you all. So thank you. Keep doing what you're doing. I'll keep doing what I'm doing. And see you next time.